everybody welcome back to channel me today i'm here to share about all these sales purchases that i've made during this sales season um apart from the previous video that you guys have already seen probably the dior one and i bought some moschino bought some kenzo skirt and i i can't remember what i got in my last video but i bought too many things during this season and um today i actually wanted to share some of the sales items that i've purchased as well um i actually shared today because the toss and the gucci's purchase are bought today because um that's where gucci sales actually started today um i actually booked my really really nice as a harry um, from the marina bay sand store to to actually reserve some of the shoes in the size that is my size for me and he did uh, reserve uh, but a lot of them actually doesn't suit me in terms of the the style as well as it will be painful and all those things my feet is very sensitive to paint so end of the day i only got like one pair of shoes from gucci um, which is my size because the rest are like kind of like half size bigger one size bigger and all those things and like my size is like 35 it's really like out of stock in a lot of the style and i got some of the things that I've bought from Gucci, um, which is the majority of the things that I got today, as well as some other things that I want to share with you that I've purchased, um, taught um, today as well from today. And one more thing that is the Proenza Schooler raincoat, raincoat that I've actually purchased together with my Proenza PS1 Micro long, long ago, like probably in the previous, previous, previous videos that you probably have seen, um, that um, they only reach, recently reached me like during this week so they took a long long time to actually ship out the clothing that you bought from them which is quite ridiculous and it's really unacceptable for an online platform but um the reason why um let's start with the Provenza school I want so let me show you what it is so look this is the wand the the the, the Provenza school raincoat yep it's very long but I'll actually show you a photo so, um I'll share a video later when I'm wearing it when I'm wearing this on. Um, it's actually Proenza Schooler White Label, and the reason that I actually wanted to buy a raincoat, uh, a better raincoat, that was because uh, when I was with Ruby in Edinburgh, and it's Scotland actually rain all the time during October, and we look ridiculous wearing the disposable raincoat, the, the, the two dollars kind, you know, that every time you wear it, you have to throw it away. And that was ridiculous on us because we have so many things that we want to take care of. Like imagine the bags that we are carrying, the the bags that we are bringing out and the shopping bags that we buy. So we want to keep it all intact and protect that under our raincoat. So that was quite ugly. I'll how leave a photo here with us in our ridiculous disposable raincoat. But yeah, that actually saved us a lot um, during the trip in Scotland and Paris during the rainy days, rainy seasons in October. That, that's where Ruby and I, we actually thought that we, we might need better raincoats, especially if we are going out during the um, autumn seasons or, or rainy seasons and things like that. So that is the Provenza Schooler one. And that actually costs 200 plus, I believe. Um, so let's move on to the Provenza Schooler, like, you know, the video of me sh showing you guys how it looks when it's on me. It's just going to be a very quick review about this Provenza Schooler white label raincoat that I've got. So there is actually a, a logo here, Provenza Schooler logo here, and also a, a very big one here as well. And this is in the red color with the buttons that are like just like a snap buttons that is easy to actually in in rainy days it's easy to actually you know snap it down and open it and actually came with a hoodie as well so that if it's raining you just have to like you know cover yourself protect yourself and then it actually has a slip pocket here quite cool and quite nice yeah but i think i paid like 200 plus for this Raincoat is pretty. It's pretty okay, I feel, as compared with the previous one that I had, like those two dollars disposable one. So this is quite good. And I believe that it can last for a couple, more, couple more times instead of every time you use it, you throw it away. So this is pretty good, I think. So before I start, let's move on to the Tots and Gucci unboxing.
welcome back. So let's move on to the purchase that I made today. The first purchase that I made today was actually the Tots Lovely Shoes because um, I was waiting for Gucci stores to actually open at 11.30 a.m. and I reached I reach earlier than that. So Tots was just beside Gucci in Marina Bay Sands and I actually walked in to actually try out their sales item and that's where Ruby actually found this lovely shoes. She actually liked the white one but I prefer the black one. It's more functional for me and this is actually the um, Alba 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 Alba's um, collection which is called the Happy Moments. It's a collaboration limited edition that um, Alba Alba's did together with Tots. So they have a lot of very um, very very cool element. So I really hope that this one doesn't hurt because I can't actually wear covered shoes. But this is actually um, in a soft material like a um, fabric material. So I do hope that it's it's, it's comfortable. So it actually came with um, a special box as well. It's the special red box, um, the happy moments box, uh, red one in color. And I'm actually wearing size 35. So yeah, and, and actually I uh, really want to thank the two lovely essays that actually served me today. One is Bond. She actually saw my video before and that was a surprise to me, as well as uh, Geraldine. They are really, really good service um, personnel and um, please visit and find them if you guys have the chance to visit Tots in Marina Bay Sands. So yeah, let me open this. So apart from that, they actually came with the special happy moments, um, like you know, care card, as well as the happy moments dust bag. This is unlike the usual one. So this is the Elba Elbas, Elba Elbas collection, um, the capsule collections. They call it the happy moments as well as the tissue inside is actually um you know with the the collaboration theme so it's pretty cool i mean it's pretty it's pretty out of the norm from the normal um tots classic boxes i think so it's, it's pretty cute and all i wanted is actually for this shoes to actually be comfortable and the good thing about this was that I don't have to fix the bottom so I can just wear it very, very straight away. That's cool. That's exactly what I like. So I don't have to spend additional money to actually fix the, fix the sole. So this is done. So let's move on to the main, main thing today which is actually the Gucci sales. I think Gucci actually didn't have sales for a couple years already. Like previously for many years I've been to Gucci and they actually told me that they don't do sales anymore. So I don't know why suddenly there's like sales this year. I don't know whether it's due to COVID since a lot of the big brands in Europe, they are actually going sales as well, especially for brands that have never gone on sales before. For example, Delvo, for example, Moinat, um, Moine, or whatever, how you pronounce it. In in in, in Europe, they're actually going on 30% sales. Um, and it's a really big deal because they usually don't or they have never ever in their history before. So anyway, let's move on to the Gucci one. So um, as you guys know that um, I've actually um, already reviewed one of the items that I bought from Gucci is actually this one that is the Zumi um, new um, that is actually short and I actually hope that it's, it, it, it's, it's actually nice walking out on the street and not hurting because I actually own a lot of like luxury shoes but I seldom use them because I really hate it when they hurt me halfway when I'm out. Obviously, if I'm just going out for dinner and drinks, I just took a cap there, have my dinner and drinks, taking a cap back home. No problem with that at all, but it's just that they always fail me. <laughs> I don't know, I, um, my feet is like not fitted for like good shoes, I think. So this one, I tried on the, on the boutique. It's, it's pretty reasonable. It's not as hot as the MS one. The MS parody shoe, I'm still like breaking it in after so many years. It still hurts. My toes, my toes still hurt, especially this two part. So for this one, even though you see that it's pointed, but um, the toe actually just came up to here. So it's pretty okay. I'm just a little bit afraid of this part only. Whether does it hurt hurt my my the back of my feet? So it's just this part. As the, of course, my toe, which is the really common one, which is actually the big toe and the little toe. Like usually, it's, these are the things that hurt. But this is the leather seems more reasonable. It's slightly softer as compared to the. MS Paradise one, which hurt so much after so many years, like the the, the the toe part. Yeah, but obviously I hope that this doesn't hurt and it actually came, I, and I will have to fix the bottom with the sole. So this is one part. And then the second item that I've actually got is this, it's a t-shirt that's also on 20%, uh, 40, uh, 50 percent sales. I actually wanted a white one, but they don't have this in stock anymore. So you can see, I think this is a little bit oversized. They told me that. I don't even know what size is this. Oh. 
maybe S or what, I don't know, it's just, it's just very big. And I actually look at the receipt, right? I don't know if they charge me incorrectly or not, but this was on the tag was 830. So after discount, it should be 415. But on my receipt, it was actually 420. So I'm not really sure. I'm actually checking with Harry, like what is the actual price of this, like, you know, Gucci tennis shirt that is in pink color. I actually don't buy pink. It's usually white or black for me. So this one is really the first one that I'm getting that is in a very weird color. But uh, I'll show you a photo on how I looked wearing this. It's pretty good. This is made in Italy, according to the tag. And one thing that I like most from today's purchase was actually um, the dress that I've got from Gucci. I will also show you the photo later, but let's just see the dress. It's a very short dress, a short mini dress, and it's like sleeveless, which is really good for Singapore weather. The material is really, really soft. It's made in Italy as well, and I think that's a size 36. I don't think they have anything smaller than that. So this retails for 1,500, and after this kind of 750, it's again 50% 50, 50 sales. So yeah, this actually really has a very soft material. So whatever you wear underneath has to be like, you know, seamless, so that it's, it doesn't sleep shown on the outside, the lines doesn't show outside. So yeah, this is the irritating part. But anyways, um, this, these are all pretty good deals that I have during the sales seasons. And um, yeah, we, we Ruby and I has been going to Marina Bay Sands for way too many times during the seasons because every of the boutiques actually starts sales differently. Like we went Fendi today to actually try the um, try the shoes that are on sales, but it really doesn't suit us and it's quite painful. So we didn't get any from Fendi at all. Um, I think this is actually the first sales that we didn't get anything from Fendi. We used to always get like maybe shirts or shoes or whatever, but this is probably the first that we didn't buy anything from them. As well as Balmain. Balmain sales is really bad this time as well. So yeah, I guess this is all for today. I really hope um, every one of you that actually came out from the circuit breaker or came out from lockdown or anything actually can like buy something to reward yourself that you've been through these, we're all passed through these and we will, go, we will grow to be stronger and happier all together. So thank you very much for watching Channel B. Please remember to like and subscribe to our videos. Bye!